My name's Aaron Croman, here to teach you Photoshop, and I'm going to show you how to draw the sea. So we're going to use a layer effect, this little circle here. Uh, we're going to use gradient. Mm, that doesn't look like the ocean. So let's make our own. First of all, I'm going to go here. The top ones is the opacity, so how light or dark or how see-through it is. I'm going to set that all the way back up to 100. And I'm going to change the color. Uh, the color's on the bottom. Just kind of make it a real light one. And then go this color and change it. Uh, so hit OK and OK. And looks interesting. Photoshop is a very powerful tool for artists. Now I'm going to show you a technique to make your project even better. It needs a little bit more to it. So let's make a new layer. And uh, I currently have it set on black and with the fill tool. So let's fill that layer. And then let's go to filter, render, fibers. And uh, kind of put the variance kind of low and strength as well. So we've got like about 16 and about 10. You can put them both on 10, just make it easier. OK. Then let's uh, put a glass effect. We're going to filter, distort, glass. OK, so we already have the texture on frosted. Let's, uh, Make it a little bit smoother. There we go. Let's make it a lot smoother. And knock down the distortion a little. And hit OK. And now we're going to uh, go to Edit, Transform, and ro rotate this layer 90 degrees so it's on its side now. And then we're going to hit multiply. So now it works with this layer and now we kind of have this nice ocean. can maybe put a background. But yeah, this is what it looks like. My name's Aaron Croman and good luck with Photoshop.